Welcome to my first disc golf vlog. I don't have an intro, so let's just roll some pictures. Hey, what's up everybody? As you can see, I'm not in Nashville anymore. I am here at the Casa de Williamson, back home for the weekend for the Ledgestone Insurance Open. Uh, it's been a rough couple of weeks. I haven't been able to work much. We had a little accident at work. It wasn't my fault, but it just kind of sucks that I haven't been able to make any money. Haven't really been able to work much. I've been working a little bit from home, but haven't been able to put too many hours in. So I got to come home a couple days early though, which is really nice. I've been spending time with some friends. Uh, so that's really awesome, and I'm playing my first A-tier tournament ever. This is the first year I have been a PDGA member. I played one sanctioned tournament earlier this year, and it didn't go so well. My rating is not anywhere close to what I want it to be, so I'm hoping that this weekend at the Ledgestone Insurance Open, we can make it happen. I got to show you one thing first. Look at the kitties. Kramer. Hey. And then we got Newman there in the background, too. <laughs> Anyways, we're going to head over to the Fly Mart and all of that over at Sunset here in a little bit. But I'm really excited to also see Simon and Eagle play because I've never seen them play before. Uh, it's going to be a great weekend. We'll see how it goes. Casey and Cody are also playing in the tournament. So we'll be giving you our thoughts throughout the weekend on how our rounds go and all of that good stuff. So this is it for now. I'll see you at Sunset. Do it for the vlog, boys. Casey? No. Casey? No. Do it for the vlog? No, I'm not doing it for anything. I'm doing it to get my sweet. You know what? We might as well all go back to the car and just put our players back. Okay, here we are, day one. We went to the Fly Mart last night. It was super awesome. We also got to meet Paul McBeth, the GOAT, at a uh, check in last night. I'll probably uh, show a picture of all of us right now. So that was really awesome. Our players pack was great. We got these sick hats. We got a jacket with the Ledgestone Insurance Open logo on it. Uh, we got a Grip 6 belt. We got a couple other things, some coupons and stuff like that. We also got some plastic here. We got a Comet, a Raptor, the new Onyx that isn't even out yet. And then we got the, uh, the full foil Ledgestone Buzz right there. But uh, day one, I'm going to head over to... Jared and Casey's here in a minute to go warm up a little bit. I tee off at 10.57, and it is currently 9.30, so I'm going to warm up for an hour, hour and a half or so, uh, try to get some shots and some putts going. Uh, hopefully we have a hot round. It's supposed to start storming about two hours after I tee off, so hopefully we're getting close to being done uh, by the time that rolls around. And then we might go check out the pros uh, after we're done, depending on what that storm does. So... Let's do it. We got the boys. The boys. Casey, how you feeling? Pretty good. And then we got the two caddies on the day. They, I suck so bad that they actually didn't have a pool bad enough for me, so I actually had to caddy. So, when do shout I out get, to all the caddies. When do I get paid for this, Casey? <laughs> <laughs> so Tommy's caddying for me, and Jared's well, caddying for Casey. Hang on, now I've got some steak in there. $5. Jared's getting, sounds awesome. Jared's getting five bucks if Casey gets a payout. What am I getting? Uh, uh, -oh. uh, a meal, maybe? Okay, I'll take that. All right. So, uh, we're going to head over to Bradley here in just a few minutes, I think. So, uh, it's going to be a good day. Okay, just got done with the first round of Friday. 
and uh, as you can see, it has rained quite a bit. I have some uh, some footage of the outside for y'all, but uh, got through. I got Tommy here with me too. Tommy caddied for me. Got through. What do you think? How many holes did we get through before it started? Really start? We got through like. 15, 14, 15 I'd holes? I'd say 14 or 15 before yeah. it really started coming down. We got through about 14 holes before it really started coming. It was sprinkling for the couple holes before that. And then the last two were The last two rough. were, it was pouring basically. They just, like literally after we turned our card in, they that guy had a rain delay. They, they sounded the horn for a rain delay. So we got pretty lucky, but Casey is still out on the course. <laughs> so that really sucks. But uh, did not have a great round. I had a little bit of a first day tournament nerves. Uh, my putting was pretty good, but my forehands were uh, not great, to say the least. But honestly, after it started raining, I started getting a little more relaxed, and I started uh, playing a little bit better. So I had a 65, which is not good. I uh, wanted to have under 60, but... Uh, We'll come back. We're playing here again tomorrow, so we'll come back tomorrow, and we will go get them. I might have some footage later, but for right now, we're going to sign off. I might see you tomorrow. We got the man cleaning yeah. off his discs. Yeah. What did you shoot, at 62 the first round? Yep, 62. Uh, round was going great until it started raining, and I bogeyed out. Um... Not really what I'm looking for, so I hope we can stay clear weather tomorrow so I can hopefully build off of what I was doing before the rain happened. Yeah, I hear you. Yeah, so he went 62, I went 65. Uh, I actually played really well after the rain uh, came. I had my first first and only two of the day, and I think I parred out the rest of the holes. So uh, it's supposed to be clear tomorrow, maybe some rain in the afternoon, but hopefully we're done by then. So. Hopefully. Uh, we're gonna hit it hard tomorrow. Try to make some progress, move up the field a little bit, and hopefully cash. Hopefully cash. Be good to go. And then we'll have the big day at McNaughton to turn it around. Hopefully, so that'll be fun. We'll have some video tomorrow for you. Okay, everybody, here we are, day two. Uh, it is about ten in the morning. I tee off at ten forty-eight. I am currently in forty-seventh place. Uh, three shots ahead of me is tied for 25th, I believe. No. Yeah, yeah tied for 25th. That's where yeah. Casey's at. It's a big jump. Casey's tied for 25th. So, it's moving day. Hoping to at least shoot a 60. That would be nice today. Uh, maybe move up a couple of places. Uh, hopefully about 10 places, I would guess. So, that's where we're at today. We're going to head over to Braddon and... Uh, I'm feeling primed. I'm feeling ready. Had some orange slices this morning. Oh, yeah. Vitamin C, baby. Vitamin C. Or something. And H2O. <laughs> That's the recipe for success. Well, Tommy, how did our round go today? Depends on what you're talking about. Talk about the first 16 holes. I went pretty good. Talking about the last two holes, not so good. Not quite. OB on the last hole, 35 foot roll away on the hole before that. Took a 67. So, not great. Playing McNaughton tomorrow, that should be plenty of fun. But we had a fun day. Hello. Mom got to have her first disc golf experience. What did you think? I think I'd like to join. I'd like to start doing this. Yeah. Get my friends involved. So if she wants to start playing, it's too bad that I am now in Nashville instead of here to take her. So, mm -hmm. But we'll get her playing, I guess. So. I can practice without you. She's going to practice without me and probably be better than me next time I see her. So. Take it from me. That's how it goes. <laughs> All right. Well... We will see you at McNaughton tomorrow. Hey, what's up, people? So, uh, yesterday, it's actually Monday right now. Uh, I played yesterday. I felt really bad, so I didn't take any video or anything. I played awful. Felt awful. Uh, but I had a great weekend. I got to see a bunch of friends. Uh, my buddy Lucas, or my buddy, my cousin Lucas, came and caddied for me yesterday because Tommy uh, was not available. He had some stuff going on. So shout out to Tommy 
and Lucas for kiting for me this weekend. You guys were a big help. Uh, carrying that bag during tournament rounds is not fun sometimes, so I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Uh, finished, like, in the 50s out of 60 people, so not great for my first big tournament, but uh, it is what it is. I'm on my way back to Nashville right now. I'm at the gas station, and I don't know if you can see it, but I went to McDonald's as well. So I'm going to have some food, uh, try to get home, get some rest, and we're back to work tomorrow. So all in all, it was a pretty good weekend. Might see you guys back in Nashville. Okay, so we just got home. We're back at the pad. Some of y'all might not have seen this yet. It's a little dirty right now. But uh, anyways, made it back about 20 minutes ago. Just got done unpacking some of my stuff. Uh, got a lot of discs in the players pack and I took some extras so I had to get those out of the car and all that. But anyways, I was feeling pretty down about my round earlier today while I was driving. But uh, you know, the more I think about it, this is my first year playing tournaments and to be playing a big three day tournament like that to honestly not get last one, that's what I was supposed to get. I was the lowest rated player going into this thing in my division. So uh, being the lowest rated player and not getting last like I was technically supposed to, I mean, I can't really be that mad about it. So uh, all in all, I had a great weekend. I got to see a lot of people that I haven't seen uh, in quite a while. So that was really nice. Um, so yeah, it was a good weekend. Also, this coming weekend, we're playing in a tournament at Seven Oaks Park on Sunday, and Casey and Tanner are coming down here to play that. Jared's coming with them as well, so might do a little vlog action for that, but for right now, this has been my journey through the Ledgestone Insurance Open. I hope you all had a good time watching this. I appreciate y'all. Peace and love.